The oil industry unveiled a capping device on Thursday in Brazil that should help to limit the potential catastrophic effects that can occur when an offshore well blows out. Oil Spill Response Limited, known as OSRL, a group of over 160 energy-related companies, presented the new equipment at the inauguration of their new base in Angra dos Reis in Brazil. Offshore oil drilling safety has been of tremendous public concern since BP's 2010 oil spill in the Gulf of Mexico. OSRL will house what they are calling a cutting-edge device capable of shutting in and controlling volatile subsea wells at the new Brazilian base. OSRL Chief Executive Officer Robert Lim said that the new device is essentially what had to be created to stop the Macondo crisis. I think the incident that everybody is in everybody's minds is the Macondo incident in the Gulf of Mexico, which uh, obviously took quite some time to uh, cap. Um, in the end, they used a similar kind of device to this, but basically had to make that on the fly, really, while they were uh, the incident was occurring. Chairman of OSRL John Lay said that the device fills a need that the industry realised too late that it lacked. You know, the industry recognised that there was a gap in the toolkit after Macondo, and uh, and so nine organisations uh, basically got together and uh, you know started a, a project. Subscribing oil and gas companies will be able to call on OSRL's device in the case of a subsea blowout. It can be readily used on the majority of active subsea wells and up to depths of 3,000 metres. The capping device is part of a package of service that OSRL provides to subscribers, which also includes tools for clearing debris in addition to the capping equipment.